What's going on everybody? Uh, Strix back at it with more Marvel Snap and today I'm playing the Big G. This is my Galactus deck. Now, I want to talk about the elephant in the room. A lot of people have been talking about the latest OTA update in which they decided, you know, because Alioth came out, a lot of people have been really favoring uh, your boy Galactus, you know? They really like, you know, the last turn, you know, the last turn play where it's only one lane and suddenly, you know, my opponent may have like a really cool move coming up ahead soon, uh, then suddenly, Ali off, you know? So, yeah, obviously, um, Galactus got nerfed a little bit. He got hit with uh, two points down from original power, so, not, I mean, I'm gonna say it, kind of a kind of a big blow but you know what that's not gonna stop me you think that's gonna stop me from you know calling forth the big man himself you think that's gonna stop me from calling forth galactus to ruin the days on your nah fam nah if anything this just wants me to play galactus even more because I, you know, even with the one power, like two power deep, uh, not deep, uh, even with the two power uh, nerf, I still think it's still possible to utilize Galactus if played properly. You know, I think the, still the key strategy here is utilizing the goblins, as you can see. Green goblin hanging out. Ah, uh, let's see what he's doing here. Wolf's Bane. Oh, he's doubling up Wolf's Bane. Oh, look at all of that power. Along with Double Wong and Mystique. Wow, what a tragedy were it to happen if just somebody came and destroyed all of your hard work. Oh, what a horrible, horrible time realizing that the game is up. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. This is why people think it's unfair to have Alioth after Galactus. This is why people still don't like Galactus. But you know what? Unfortunately for you, I don't think you get it. No matter what you've tried, you did the nerfs by having it with making it like power prio. You tried debuffing him just a little bit. It doesn't matter. Galactus players will always, always find a way to interrupt your little parties, you know? They're still gonna find a way to just come in and be like, hey, What's going on? Big G, you know? That's gonna happen. Just letting you know now that's the fate that you just gotta accept it. All right, anyway. Ooh, sorry. Look, I, oh, double wave action. <laughs> Look, man, I love Galactus, okay? And it could, I don't know if it's just me, but you know, I just love when he comes in and suddenly it's a one location scenario, like right now. Look, I don't need to look at your car. You don't gotta show me what you just played. Maybe it's the big thing that's gonna change, you know, you're gonna turn the tide for you. Nah, fam. I'm just gonna blow that up in your face. Bye bye. Oh, he's snapping. He's confident. He thinks he can manage a win. Let's see what he's gonna do. I'm curious. I'm gonna the hobgob out here. He's putting the DD Devil Dino out as well. Brought it down to a. Uh, a nice little, ooh, now he's winning. But I got the cards. He's playing one card, Odin. Ooh, he was relying on that to see him through. He was gonna send Hobgob back, but he didn't think I was gonna drop this many cards. Ah, boy, unfortunately, here, take another goblin. Take a second, have all the goblins. Have all the Normans and the, um, that other dude, who's Hobgoblin? Wait, oh God, who's Harry? Harry Osborne. Have Normans and Harrys. Have all the, all the Osborns. Gal Galactus is there to just take on, take him, take him in. You know. Whew, sorry. Look. <laughs> uh, I want to ask: Is it what's so wrong? What's so wrong with me being, like, just a heavy duty Galactus fan? You know. I look. I get it. It's fun to, uh, you know, I know that there are people like, I'm not gonna not deny it. There are people that are gonna say that it, you know, it sucks the fun out of the game. It's super unfair. And it, you know, it, 
it takes away from the gameplay because suddenly you have to make meta decks to counter Galactus, and that's not fun. But, you know, I feel like they've changed the game to, uh, for, uh, to bring down Galactus so much that it is a little bit easier, you know? If you play your cards right and, like, build a strategy, you know, like, there are certain strategies, obviously, that will be not as good against Galactus, and there's going to be strategies that are better against Galactus, for sure, you know? Uh, and that's just the roll of the dice. Like, same thing with, like, you're going to say the same thing about every other deck. You're going to say the same thing about Destroy, about, um, what, Cosmo deck. You're going to say the thing about a uh, high evolutionary deck. It's just what it is. So, look, just like Big G right here is about to just wreck your world, you know, about to just destroy everything that your my opponent knew and loved. Look at all the stuff that he did. He had all these fun cards like armor, and he's got he had uh, rogue. He had Spider Man 2099, all that. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> See, this is exactly what I'm saying. You know what? Look, look. Just because I destroyed everything doesn't mean that a Norse, uh, you know, a big Norse buff dude can just go in and send your boy back. So hey, just have fun. Have fun.